awesome. She's converted. is the God's Thumb Trail slash the Knoll Trail. I don't know if they're different. Yeah, in Lincoln City, Oregon, August 9th, 2020. We made a turn for the God's Thumb and there were no signs to point us and there's nothing on Google that says which way to go. So we hope we are going in the right direction. Apparently we went in the correct direction. Hooray for us. Hooray for intuition, I guess, or whatever do you want to we call it. We figured it out a little bit. West got some being on the west. We went westerly. We weren't sure which one it was though. There you go. It's got a lot windier and the temp just dropped probably. Probably a good 10 degrees. Yeah, what do you say? 10? 10? Put a number on it, 10. we have left to go down to the sea lion cave and we are protected from, from large groups of <laughs> the Spanish families families I feel like I was on an elevator
Find the bird shit. It sounds so stupid. This is the trail to natural, to natural bridges in Oregon, uh, just north of Brookings. Oh, my knee. Check it out. spot. Continuing with the precipice theme of this trip. Yeah, narrow spits of land is what we do. Rocks. Apparently now, <laughs> I guess. Not all the time. No. Nope. We don't have those no. in Florida. <laughs> but it's a very pretty spot. Driftwood City. Welcome to Driftwood City. Home of Driftwood, if you hadn't figured it out. We're collecting some, I'm gonna make a campfire with Driftwood tonight. Big rocks, lots of them in Oregon. That one someday is going to fall right into the sea or onto the beach right there. I'm gonna go put my feet in the water. Test its temperature, which is cold. I already know. That's okay. Upper 50s, something like that. <laughs> Chilly, not terrible. I am the hunter, she's the gatherer. Yes. <laughs> Except I don't really hunt anything, but that swell and she gathers wood if you know what I mean oh hoping it will be so <laughs> Redwood Nature Trail outside of Brookings Oregon this is where we are we are here it doesn't have the trail map in there no. Oh, it's a loop. Yeah, it must be the end of the loop over there. Look at that big boy. Yeah. It's very stringy. Probably not supposed to do that. Well, check it out, another bridge. Didn't even know that was there.
very red in that light. Oh, it looks like a total, you know, like a lamb head or something, or a goat head. Yeah, I don't know if it does. More big trees. It happens. Creating a large hollow. This weakened the tree enough so that it eventually broke and fell. Redwood is renowned for its ability to resist rot and decay. However, you can see signs of wood decay on the surface of this tree. The decay probably entered the wooden xylem and phloem. Like some of it is the the where the sap, like the water goes up to the leaves and then out the sap goes through and like, I don't know, it's really like the vein equivalent of tree. Tree veins? Yeah, tree veins. Mm. It's interesting to see it like so clearly, like electrical wires or something. True veins. Can you see that? Oh, it did, did it. Did it work? Yeah, GoPro yeah. stop recording. So, do you want to recap the day for us? Like as a <clears throat> journal entry number, whatever it is. Sure, what did we do today? <coughs> um, Woke we... up in the van. Yep, woke up in the van. Uh, didn't have to pee as badly, that was nice. Oh, went to, what, Bandon Beach? Yep. That was killer. Got coffee, went to Bandon Beach. Uh, found a dead seagull. Um, saw a mama deer and two little fuzzy baby ones. And drove Kitten south. Kitten rocks. Cat and kitten, cat and kittens. Yep. Um, drove south through Gold Beach, which is where we are now. Um, natural bridges. Yep, we did natural bridges, which was steep as shit, but worth it. I have a few of the little pieces of rocks that break off because they, some of them have this like purple sheen to them. And, I didn't and get some succulents from the cliff. And some succulents from the cliff, that's right. Those cute little rose-colored star ones. And I got a resurrection fern for free from the lady at the coffee shop, Tasty Kate's. That, I was pumped on that. Uh, so what, natural bridges. Yep. Um, and then we did the Redwood Trail. Then the Redwood Trail, that's right. It's awesome. Redwood Trail in Brookings. In Brookings, right? Which is almost, almost to California. California. Yeah. Uh, then came back to Gold Beach. Then did a hike at what is it? Sebastian Cape Sebastian. Yeah, something Cape Sebastian like Point or something. Yeah. A rushed sunset hike because we thought Racing. we were gonna have a good photo payoff. Racing <laughs> to catch the sunset, but really going too far. We should have quit. I think we've much sooner, but the trail trying. was cool. We were looking for a vantage point that wasn't there. Yeah, I expected one, and I didn't really know the trail, so we oh, rushed no through foul. it and <laughs> zero payoff. Well, no, it wasn't zero. No, the trail yeah, was really just cool. No f photographic yeah. evidence. Yeah, we collected driftwood for a driftwood fire, which I'm now enjoying. Yeah, at a, a beach that starts with an H. Harris Park. Ha Harris Harris Beach Park. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. All these events are not exactly in order, but <laughs> it's what we did today. Mm -hmm. We did three, three good, two and a half good hikes. Yep. I mean, the red one was good. It just wasn't like work. And that's August. August what? Tenth. Tenth. Uh, 10th, August yep. 10th, Monday, August Monday, 10th. motherfucker. We didn't go.
clear the water is. Captain's log, about four hours later, we're at Crater Lake. That's Wizard Island right there. It is not a filter, the water is really that blue. Falls. We're here. Here we are. Tamawanas Falls Trail, making our way up to Tamawanas Falls. Here we are. We are here. Tired? Uh-huh. <laughs> Rock surfing. I did it better up there. 